We talked about targets. We talked about, we talked about focus. What's your mission? What's your dream? Why? My father talked about that this morning. Hey, there's days you don't feel like it. There's days I don't feel like it. But when I don't, what am I going to do? My why, call me, call me crazy. There's plenty of people have. I want to help every insurance agent in the world at some point in the future. It's, it's, it's probably impossible. But that's what I wake up and write down every single morning. I'm big on goals. I write down goals every single day. Immediate goals. The next year goal. A long-term goal. Goals keep you focused. But what's really cool about goals and goal setting When you set a high target, when you write it down daily and you don't give up on it, it forces you to work harder. It forces you to be more creative. And you end up doing way more than you thought. If I would have said, hey, we're going to have almost 1,100 people sign up for a conference in Nashville four and a half months ago, I didn't even believe it. But we're doing it now. Because what? We set a high target, I wrote it down every day, and we never gave up on it. Because what happens is, most people, we can set a high target, hey, I'm going to do this, great. We write it down a few days, then we, then we give up. But what happens is, say, say your goal is to make, you know, $2,000 a week. And then the week you don't, what happens? What do we do next? We lower it. We can do something different. We can be more creative. We can push a little harder. We can grind a little harder. Do not, do not lower your goal because you're, you're psychologically telling yourself, apparently I can't do it. These are the goals I wrote down June 6th of 2018. You can see the third one. This is, this is real. Thousand plus person conference in October of 2018. This is, a, this is straight from my little goal book. I won't call it a diary because I don't write anything in it, but I do write my goals down. And so I show that as an authentic way of saying, hey, goals work. It forced us to be more creative. It forced us to have people like Ray Lewis, Tim Story, Grant Cardone, Nissan Stadium involved because I wrote the goal first. Did you catch that? I wrote the goal first and figured out the rest later. Who, 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 who follows us on either uh, YouTube or Facebook? Nice. We came up with the conference, I think it was like May 30th, I believe. It's June 6th. It's June 6th. We came out, and I kind of teased a little on YouTube, said, hey, I got something big going on. I'll let everybody know in the next day or so. And then we end up Releasing it to the world, no clue when the dates are going to be. Who cares? You guys are going to show up anyway. Nissan Stadium, you know, I don't know where the venue is going to be. Luckily, the Titans are on a buy this week. I set the date before I even booked the venue. I didn't know who was going to speak. Vince was the first one we got on board. In the, in the early days, it was, it was, it was, it was me, me and Vince going to be in this thing. <laughs> hey, it's still been a heck of a conference. 